Hey, I'm Michelle Pollock, and you're listening to Rocking at the Movies with Shane Cumley White. Welcome everybody, my name is Shane Cumley White, and you're with me at Rocking at the Movies, and today we have a special guest, a local actress who is from Cape Town and her name is Michonne Pollock. So Michonne, welcome so much to our show and I really, really appreciate giving us the time to actually have a chance to chat to you and learn a little bit about who you are, what you are and what you have done. So it's a very warm welcome from myself and hope that our listeners and our viewers are very interested in what you're going to tell us and have to say. Thank you so much and thanks for having me. It's um, it's always great to chat to you. To, um, uh, other people in the industry. No, definitely. It is always, it's amazing to just find out where all the people are from and also just to get an idea of who you are and what you've done. And that that's, for me, is very inspiring, you know, just to get an idea of what's going on, how you started. So tell us a little bit more about yourself and how you actually got into it, if you don't mind. Hmm. So I was born in East London yeah. and um, my dad's a photographer and so from a young age i had a lot of experience in front of the camera and um and also behind the camera and um my mom is incredibly talented creatively and she taught me all about coloring outside of the lines so i've always um known that i've wanted to be in a creative industry and um acting is the one thing that um that i feel allows me to to connect with with parts of myself that I, I probably uh, well that I wouldn't with with any yeah. other job right have you tried any other kind of work or is, is this where you've actually just gone and you've put yourself into acting completely and just pushed for push that um, no so I also write I've hmm. got a, um, a book that's coming out end of the year it's a poetry book and um so busy with the editors at the moment on that brilliant um, and then i also um i also paint and draw and i've got my work in some galleries in cape town and yes. um i ran a fashion a fashion line for a while i started that and um i ran it for about nine years and and then i decided to uh to rather take that energy and put it into into acting that's amazing. Now, you say that you did art. What, what kind of art did you do? What kind of, um, what was your, your, how can I say, your inspiration or, or the stuff that you actually did? Because I also studied art as well, so that's why I'm asking. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. So tell oh, me about what you did. Yeah. Yeah, so I do, um, I work a lot from the blind drawing process yeah. and I usually start off with that and and then I develop that into oil paintings and uh, and also line, draw, uh, line drawings. Brilliant. And did you actually study it or did you just do it as something like a hobby and then just get into that from there? Um, so uh, back at school, yeah. <laughs> I did art. And um, on the weekends, I was part of art groups, and mm. we had artists that we worked with and and trained with. Brilliant. No, because I also I did art for two and a half years. I went to a normal school, if you want to call it that, um, and I couldn't do the history and the geography, and it just bored me so much. Um, even though I understand it completely, it's just I couldn't grasp it, if that makes sense. Um, and then my parents were amazing and they actually took me out of their school and put me into an art school and we did 16 subjects at a time and it was sculpture um pottery painting um silk screening the works and it was the best time of my life when it came to schooling and i just loved it you know and it was it was a proper college it was we started at seven in the morning and finished at about five in the afternoon so it was a full 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 day worth of just uh, exploring and creating yeah and i still got my one sculpture oh, I which is, yeah, so that's why I love it. I love art. And I think that's also why I'm in this. This is how I got into the the the, the TV or the, the radio stuff that I do as well because of that, you know. And how, how did you actually get into the, the TV? What was your first, or movie, what was your first um, point of call, if that makes sense? Um, I, so I started off modeling mm -hmm. and... Um, and while I was modeling, I uh, was training in the evenings with acting coaches. And 
the more I, the more time I spent training and working on my craft, the more I just realized that there was, there's nothing else in the world that I'd rather be doing. And um, it was great because modeling was a good platform to then um, get into TV commercials. And uh, that's also, it was just working on sets and um and then yeah and then in, into film and tv and that's how it all works that's amazing because um a lot of people i must say i'm one of them never thought i'd ever get into tv but had a lucky break beginning of lockdown and now things are starting to actually really start and it's because of these interviews with people like yourself and the others that i've dealt with as well and i think it's starting to open doors in different ways than i even thought 